Thank you. What is it? Is that it? Right guys, so we are back in Marina Mall today, going to sort out our fridge and our washing machine. Um, so yeah, and then we're gonna get everything sorted and delivered to the house. So let me show you which ones we actually went for in the end. So, yeah. how are you? Uh, we went for this washing machine, so a Samson one, and it's 8kg. And at the minute they've got like Black Friday sales, so we got we got some money back. So we're gonna get this one, and then also we um, chose which fridge is it? So we've gone for this fridge. So again, a Samson. So it's quite big inside and also it has this function where you can if you don't want the top to be a freezer then you can actually make this bit also a fridge so it's got like multi-purpose usage so you can switch from freezer to fridge and you can actually do something where you can do like a it's like a quick freezing so if you want to cool something really quickly you can do that as well so we've gone for that and we also need to get a chested freezer and a cooker but we, we saw that in a different store so we're gonna go and get that as well um, but just so you can see the type of prices that they do do and um, yeah and like things like the options that you have I'm just gonna show you guys a few of like the other big fridges and freezers and stuff like that and also we need to get some AC units as well so we're going to be doing all of that So yeah it's just in marina mall so it's a good place to come and have a look because they've got quite a good range of things um so yeah definitely worth checking it out um the person at the house was called alex so he might sign for it if i'm not okay that's but fine. then you have to tell them once the delivery note is signed that's it yeah that's it no more changes for, for dental for the, the dental yeah. okay that's fine so yeah. please 
no problem. Yeah. But then the number for the when he's about to okay, do the... I'll maybe I'll give you his number just in case. Yes. You You will need chicken. We are room. doing layer or hard chicken because we are young. Fine, if it was they few, even tell you chicken. So chicken, and then you the need joy is of um, <laughs> driving in Ghana. Yeah, roads just be blocked, and then you just gotta be finding your own way around. So like it's mad. And and so now we're basically so trying to find an alternative route because the road is blocked. Right, we need to go there. Uh, side. Or rare rank quite. Yes, I, I can help you. And the roads are bumpy. So bumpy. So guys, we are now at the house. Um, we're going to be um, getting the curtains and stuff put up so that we can have, obviously, privacy in the house. Um, so the carpenter's here. He's just having a look around. Um, he's going to fix a couple things for us. And then also we got a phone call from the delivery people to say that the fridge and stuff is going to be um, delivered soon. So we're just waiting for everyone to come. So yeah, that's the current situation. Um, and I may need to run to the store to get another curtain pole actually. So yeah, I don't know how that's going to be with the traffic. At the minute, the house is a bit of a maze. Literally, it's a maze. Um, still unpacking a lot of stuff. But in the garage, basically, we need to get mosquito net put up to stop the mosquitoes. We need to cover all of that up the top so that mosquitoes can't come in. Because at the minute, there's a lot of mosquitoes. Uh, yeah, it's better. And protect. So we're gonna add mosquito nets here to stop any mosquitoes coming through. Because we've got it here. You can just see it at the minute. You may be able to see that at the net. So this is the garage space, it's quite a big space, I'm not sure what we're going to do here yet but we might just put the gym stuff here and then it leads into like the kitchen, like the living area, got all these burglar bars, that's like a, a, a thing in Ghana, um, so yeah that's the current situation. Right guys, so these are the curtains that I actually got from Orca. Um, so they're grey curtains. They're like blackout curtains basically. Um, try to get them as long as possible. So they're quite long curtains. Good quality as well actually. Um, so yeah, we need to, need to see if these are going to basically fit the whole house. I think I feel like it's fine but I feel like I need to go and get some more right guys so the delivery people for the fridge are here so we're gonna let them in through the garage so yeah we can't wait we are excited finally have a fridge and a washing machine and do you know like your basic things that you are so used to in the uk so the fact that we have it now like it's very good letting them in Mind the tree. These people. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, it's you. Hi, it's you again. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
Then there's our new washing machine as well. Can it go here when you take it out? Or should we put it here? I've got an initial Yeah, yeah, it's going to be here for six hours. Before you put yeah, to yeah. Okay. What's that? We have to leave in the garage then. Yeah. Thank you. What's that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's fine. Any faults and the fridge as well. Okay, yeah, that's fine. So, guys, um, yeah, so that's the washing machine and the fridge now here. So, we still need to get a cooker and we also need to sort out our um cooker and also we need a chest a chest freezer because you know to just order to get like bulk food and stuff it's better to freeze it like the meats because to be just going up and down to supermarkets all the time in Ghana it's, it's a bit of a bit of a mission at times especially because we don't have a car at the minute so yeah that's that but yeah they're going now so that's everything sorted it's over with for that little bit <laughs> oh my gosh everything is sicker in this place sicker means money everything is money in this life have money as you need money trust me because it's no joke so yeah ma'am we are getting there slowly but surely it's only week two you know so it's gonna take a while to settle in properly but I mean, when you've got sunshine and you've got greenery, you've got palm trees, what more can you ask for? <laughs> so yeah, we're just waiting for also the Vodafone engineer to come because we're getting our internet installed with Vodafone. So I even think I just saw them, you know. Right, so they are connecting the internet to the power cable at the minute so they're down the road zoom in a bit you can see them down there in the distance so yeah hopefully the internet will be here soon so last time we came we had some green bananas growing actually there's still some there I don't know if you guys can see it in the back there so yeah we've got oh actually there's quite a lot there as well so we've got green bananas growing here um, so yeah, I can actually come out and just pick some green bananas, that is crazy. Yeah, it's even nice to know that you can actually grow fresh produce. I think eventually what we want to try and do is probably like turn this into something a bit more, you know, try and grow some, some vegetables and stuff. I don't know, I'm seeing like, I, think these, I don't know what these are, but, um, yeah. I'm gonna try and do do something out here, be agricultural. So, yeah. Oh yeah. Um, you guys can actually see the puppy a bit closer now. Let me show you him. So this is the puppy that has been gifted to us 
but as you can see he is very like he's got worms and stuff I think I really think he has so I'm not really trying to touch him but um he needs food and he needs defleeing and all of that stuff and I don't want it near me and now it's following me go away I don't know what he's called but I don't want him here I'm sorry I'm not keeping this dog I want a Doberman I need a security dog I don't want this dog this dog's gotta go <laughs> if anyone remembers Richard Blackwood's show you gotta go he's got to go he has to go seriously but um yeah I think I will get a dog though but not yet because I need to settle myself in first before I think about trying to add pets to the whole equation so yeah uh, let's wait for these engineers to finish this Vodafone thing and um, test out the speeds of the internet and make sure everything is in working order. Alright, so now they're outside the house um, connecting the wire that's going to come into our property. So, yeah, looks like they've finished basically. I would have shown you guys more of the process but obviously I've got to respect as well the fact that not everyone wants to be on camera so I can show what I can um, but yeah this is the process when it comes to your property um, they seem very professional actually very fast um, the fact that they call to let you know they're on their way and stuff like that so very pleased with that obviously now they're gonna drill into the house and then bring that cable through so um yeah we're gonna see how this is gonna all work out now Alright guys, so the internet is connected now, so what I'm going to do is do a speed test. So usually I use speedtest.net and this is really good because it basically just helps you see how strong the download speeds are. Um, this is probably something you need to do when you're renting or where, wherever you're going to be living because you want to be able to make sure that you can get good internet, especially if you rely on it for work and you know entertainment purposes oh, so Vodafone is is very fast if it will so that's our download speed 81.77 right guys so as it starts to get dark the mosquitoes start to appear so these are mosquito coils basically they help keep mozzies away so you can have them like near you whether you're outside or if you're in the house as well so i'm about to try this out for the first time but this is like the recommended one that everyone seems to buy you get quite a few in a pack 10 coils and this was 6 CDs I'll probably put the conversion on the screen because I'm still trying to learn <laughs> what 6 CDs is what was that roughly? $1. about 80 pence, about 80 pence for, the, the, for the British British people I am literally, look at me, I'm so, I'm tanned guys, and I'm sweaty. <sighs> this heat is serious, but I wouldn't have it any other way. 
Hey, a serious crap. <laughs> Do you know, so funny, yeah, I know I'm going to get, I'm going to get roasted trying to do any form of chi out here. Like, I'm just going to get roasted. But anyway, you just have to roll with it and just, you know what I mean? You have to embrace the culture and embrace the embarrassment and just try my best. Literally, <laughs> I'm going to try my best to, you know. So, yeah. That's that. So, we're just going to keep unpacking some things and probably call it a day um the carpenter's back he's in the back in the garage putting up the mosquito nets um he had to go and get the materials earlier um so yeah and one thing i would say as well guys yeah <laughs> and i've noticed this make sure you have like tools and stuff because earlier had to let the engineers for the Vodafone use our ladder and then even now the guy um the carpenters using our ladder so now I can see when I've watched other youtubers that have moved to Ghana saying you know like it's almost like although you're paying someone to do the job to some extent you've also kind of got to have some of the tools for them to do the job properly so yeah because uh we nearly had an accident earlier like the Vodafone engineer one of them he put the ladder up on the wall but it's like the ladder for outside like external walls the flat one and literally it just it just went like this down the wall and he nearly hurt himself so thank god we had a normal step ladder a tall one and they used that and got the job done but yeah the internet is so fast guys like it's so fast like we've been using instagram and everything um and it's like working like a dream so God willing, let it continue. <laughs> so yeah, that's kind of like been it for the day. So hopefully we can get, you know, the curtains and other things done um, this evening. But if not, you know, we've still got a few more days um, before the week ends to try and get everything in. So I'll say peace right, out. Right guys, we're back at our well i say home now but it's not our home it's our temporary home and we ordered some papa's pizzas <laughs> i love papa's pizza this is like this pizza hmm. when you come to ghana make sure you get papa's pizza yeah so we got papa's pizza and we also got um some barbecue wings let's have a look at these barbecue wings actually let's see what i want for these things there mm. Looks quite nice actually. So yeah, this was how much was it? Uh, 95 this was 95 CDs, which is about 11, 11 pounds. pounds. And this is a, is this a large or medium? Yeah. A large pizza and wings, which is quite good actually. So yeah, gonna chill out and watch them. And we got it also, yeah, like via this delivery app called, Global. let me, Global. So it's called Glow. Oops. What's it called? Glovo. Glovo. You can see the name there. Glovo. So yeah. And it came quite fast as well. So about 30 minutes. So Guangana. They're they're coming up in the world. So yeah, we're gonna watch some YouTube and chill out. So good night guys. Thank you.